Okay, fish, 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 fish. <gasps> the rarest of all the fish, an aqua bunny. Guys, my name is TVK and welcome back to another video on my channel today. I am back with another video and of course it's One Life, the massive multiplayer survival series with all of my friends. Where if you die, you're out of the server, but not only that, it will also rain every single day for the rest of your life. Unless, of course, you leave a like on this video, in which case I can then stop that from happening because I possess magical powers that can stop that from happening. Okay, you know the drill by now. Guys, I'm excited to be back on the server. First thing is first, I had a lot of you guys begging me to, to rescue Lily. Someone said I went through a lot of effort to get her. I actually didn't go through a lot of effort at all. I went through very little effort to get that one at all. It was literally just a piece of food that kept it as my pet. But I will go and collect her and I will bring her back inside to safety because, you know, she deserves it. Come on. There you go, mate. All right, Lily's safe. Oh, trapped by the dog. Lily's safe. Now we're gonna put Tenebris back away. Bam. Bam. Oh, there we go. So, as always, first thing is first in this episode, we are going to be going ahead and naming two of our fish after two of you lovely commenters. Last episode, I asked you for 10,000 likes. You guys delivered 10,000 likes. Pretty much exactly. So, way to go. Hey, hey, you're not welcome here. Huzzah! No, don't fly away. Don't fly away. Come back. I want, I want your egg. Uh. Haha, -ha. did you give me an egg? Did you drop an egg? No, it dropped this cheating stuff, which I should really see what I can make into, honestly, because I have quite a bit of it now, I think, actually. I mean, what's happening out here? Obviously, it's a storm, so, I mean, that's never great, but there's never really any danger anymore. That's the big thing, I think, with One Life, is that the point is you're supposed to be a little scared, and I'm not really ever scared anymore. Set of those things, I don't like those. They freak me out a bit, just because they're spooky. Uh, but yeah, last episode, guys, I asked you for 10,000 likes. You delivered. This episode, I'm not going to ask you for a specific amount of likes. You guys just go crazy. Do whatever you want to do. If you want to leave a like, leave a like. It means a lot to me. But if you want to be considered with a chance of having a fish named after you in the next episode, you've got to leave a like and then, of course, leave a comment with the name of what you would like the fish to be called. Right now, we're going to go get two more. I'm going to kill this and then we're going to go put some fishies in our aquarium. Come here. Come here, fake Tenebris. Where is it going? I'm not going all the way over there for it. There's no way. Don't care that much. I'm getting a fish and I'm going home. Whoa, look at the map. Scott's built a giant dolphin. That looks so cool on the map. Look at this. I actually made it harder for you to see. Hold on. Here you go. Look at that. That's pretty cool, to be fair. Scott's, like, art from above looks so cool. Big fan. Big fan, Scott. That's a deer, not a fish. I don't know much about nature, but I can tell the difference between a deer and a fish. Why are there no fish all of a sudden? Hey, you. I see you. You're my fish now. Come here. <gasps> You, the blue tang. Oh, it's a hippo tang. Well, similar thing, probably. Probably the same thing, to be fair. That is absolutely terrifying, I'll be honest. Don't mind me, just a creeper with a happy dude on his head. All right, let's go and name our very first fish of the day. Hi, Lily. Let's go down and pop this one in and pick a name. So let's go in here and throw in this a fishy. Fishy, fishy. There is the fish, and it's going to be called Wiggle Fart, which was suggested by Super Sarah, who said, CPK, can you name a fish Wiggle Fart? Of course I can. There goes Wiggle Fart. Where are the dolphins? Right, so I'm guessing Scott found out and took the dolphins at this point because no one else would have taken them. This happened, I only filmed the video where I took them like a, the blooming day ago or something, like two days ago. How did he already find out? I'm so confused. Also, I pinned a comment on my last video that asked about Edna's name and someone said, uh, like this comment if you want Edna's name to stay the same. Leave a comment if you want to change the name. It got nearly a thousand likes. So Edna is staying as Edna, guys. Let's work out where my dolphin is. I'm going to guess since Scott has now built a dolphin out of... Now I'm realizing it's actually out of impenetrable glass blocks that I have this feeling that that's where my dolphin is going to be. Oh, my two dolphins. Technically, two of them are mine. One of them was his. Is this where they're going to be? Yeah, of course. Great. Wonderful. So there's Fred, which is mine. Scooby, which is also mine. Not sure there's going to be a way into this. I imagine he's been pretty thorough with making sure that it's impenetrable. Let's have a quick look, though. It can't hurt to try, can it? How far down can he really have gone with this? Yeah, not that far down. All right, maybe we can actually get back here. Oh my god, I'm going to drown. Ooh, okay, back in. I should really just have brought a, you know, shovel. That would have really sped this whole process up, I think. Is that gonna let us in or is it gonna... Oh no, I think he might have gone all the way underneath. Uh-oh. Oh, I could not be timing that any closer. I really couldn't. Uh, okay, so is this his one? Yeah, Daphne was his. And then I tamed Fred... And then I bred them to have Scooby. I want my child back. I'm angry at everything now because Scott took my stuff. I didn't even do anything bad. I just borrowed his dolphin so that I could breed it. That's not a bad thing. Well, if that is the way he'd like to play this game, then that's the way we'll play the game. Give me back my dolphins. 
or you'll never see your fairy horse again. I'm gonna have to just literally steal it. Great. Right, well, come on, Frederick. Off we go. You're mine now. Yay for Frederick. In fact, I'm gonna hide him off camera so you guys can't even see where he is because you'll all tell on me. So... Mm. Okay, that's Frederick hidden away until we get our dolphin back um, because uh, I want my dolphins. There were two in there and uh, I wanted to breed them and now I can't because Scott stole them. Yes, I took his dolphin first, but as you guys know, it was just a little joke. It's a little jokey poo, wasn't it? And all I did was breed it. That was it. And then he could have had it back. He could have had Daphne back as much as he wanted, but no. He had to steal mine and put them in an impenetrable glass fortress. So, until I get my hot dolphins back, I have his fairy horse. Frederick belongs to me. Got completely sidetracked. We still need to find another fish. I still don't have a jellyfish, which was the whole reason I got this. The whole reason I got the fishing net is because I wanted to get a jellyfish. We're going to be naming this last fish as like the last thing we do in the episode at this rate. My goodness. Right, well, it seems like something over here is like dying. So let's go see if we can rescue it. Oh, I might have already died. Did it die? Uh-oh. Well, I don't know what it was that was dying, but it's dead. So we can't save it. Okay, fish, 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 fish. <gasps> the rarest of all the fish. An aqua bunny. What actually is that in the background? That actually does look like a fish that I don't have. Oh, I want that fish. Oh, there's a big lad goldfish. What is that one? Yeah, I don't think I have that guy. I want him. Come here. I'm mine now. Hey, okay. Good, come with me. There is another dolphin over here too. That little boar. Oh, look at the little boar. He's so cute. I love him. <gasps> Rocco 4! Sup? He's still here. Oh my goodness. I mean, I haven't seen any of the other Roccos for quite some time, but there was Rocco 1, 2, 3, and 4. So hopefully they still exist. I'd love to bump into the other Roccos at some point. Oh, wait, now... Oh, it's a chicken fat. I thought it was like a little person. Now I have the pet amulets. Can I actually take Rocco back? Rocco, would you like to come home with me, bud? Hi. You want to jump in this amulet? No. <gasps> you do? Jump in it. Yay! All right, nice. We can take Rocco home. Let's go back and catch Tenebris because Tenebris is getting away. I'll be honest, I'm mad because that dolphin does look really cool on the map. But he stole from me, so I'm not. That's not cool. Oh, God. Where's Lily the fox? Lily, where have you gone? Where have you gone? Lily. Oh, God. Where has the fox actually gone? I swear to God, if that cat killed it, I'm going to be so angry. That keeps happening. She keeps killing my pets. Okay, and the second fish uh, name is suggested by Kappa, who says, Can you name your fish? Dog, because I have a fish called Dog. Is that bad? Uh, no, I don't think that is bad. I'm actually fairly certain that Shovel has a fish called Dog, right? Or, or did, I think. I, I don't know if she still does. Uh, I can't quite remember if she still does. All right, honestly, where's the fox? I think the fox is actually dead. Oh, no, you're there. Oh, thank God. Right, let's keep you separate from the uh, from, from the crazy cat because she's she's cra like, actually nuts. Right, I was informed in the comment section by many of you guys that if I wanted to find out more about the mystery man, that I could go to his lair and apparently his lair is behind the clock at spawn. So I am willing to go and check that out uh, because I'd love to know more about him. I called him out in the last episode. It's been three days. Nothing's happened yet. So I'm not scared. Um, I may be more scared if anything ever actually happens. But for now, we're just assuming nothing's going to happen and that the mystery man is a coward. So let's go see where this supposed hideout is. Uh, apparently it's behind the clock at spawn. So I'd like to see that if it's true, if it's really real. Uh... Well, it doesn't look real. Someone told me that it was literally just right behind the clock. But, I mean, this is the clock, right? So, I mean, how far behind can it be? Unless this is it. And in which case, he chills out. And I respect that. Let me read the exact comment again. CBK, Scott sent Shovel on a quest as he stole her horse. Shovel found the mystery man's lair behind the clock at spawn. So, the mystery man could be Scott. Yeah, because we were asking who we thought the mystery man was. You know what? I'm going to put a poll on this video. And you guys should vote for who you actually think the mystery man could really be because uh, I don't know who it could be. I have absolutely no idea. Um, so I'd like to know your guys' theories and leave a comment letting me know why you think that. So I'm going to put a poll on with as many different people on as I can. I don't know how many it'll let me do, but I can't seem to find anything that looks like a lair. This is Joel's whole area. I'm not seeing it. Maybe he moved because he got discovered. Maybe he got found out and then he moved because he didn't want to get caught. That's possible, right? Or maybe I'm just missing it completely. I mean, who knows? Everyone's built little cute places for their horses to live. Maybe I should do that. I'm not being stupid here. Whoa. Oh, that's the mob. The blocks that stop mobs from spawning, isn't it? Where is it? I'm, I'm so confused. I really wish I could see it. Also, what's up here? I saw when I got up here. Look, there's... What are these blocks? Look. <gasps> there's command blocks in here. What does this do? What is this area? I'm so... Ooh, we're gonna look. Oh, I fell in. What is this? Follow me on Twitter... What is this? Okay, I'm shook and I can't get back out, actually. <laughs> is this the mystery man thing? Is this the lair? Wait, what's this? It clears all mobs. I'm so confused. I'm gonna get out of here. Whoa, what's that? I don't like these heads everywhere. It's freaking me out. I'm leaving. I'm outie. We're outie, boys. I don't want to know anything about that. I do not know what's going on. 
but it's weird and I don't want anything to do with it, all right? Leave me out of this. Is that a Rocco? That's no, just a raccoon. Oh, I thought it was going to be one of the missing Roccos. Wait, what about you? Are you a Rocco? No, just a missing raccoon. I want my missing Roccos back. I want my Roccos back. Did Joey do his quest yet? Actually, no, Joey's not very well right now, right? Joey's real sick right now, I think. So everyone should go send some love to Joey. Uh, I saw that uh, Daniel is taking care of him right now. So go send some love to Joey if you haven't already. Um, I hope he's not too sick, but I have heard he is a little ill. Uh, right, let me go ahead and pop down. Tenebris. All right. I mean, I think that's going to be it for this episode, guys. Hopefully uh, you did enjoy this one. I know a lot of it ended up actually being catching the fish, but I kept getting sidetracked. There's like a million little side things for me to do, and I kept getting distracted over and over and over again. So here's things that happened here. Scott stole our dolphins. We stole Scott's fairy horse. We still don't know who the mystery man is, but we found some weird room. And uh, I need you guys to vote in the poll and leave a like on the video and let me know who you think the mystery man is. I have been CBK. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video on my channel. Peace.